What? Jared, why'd you run off to? All right, guys, so opening the packs for the final one here. Got a lot of good cards for my mill deck now. Hey, a rupture spire. Hope Jared knows that well, we could hurry the bunt up. Oh, reshaped the earth. Did he get food on that? I don't think he did. That's why he's talking about ordering a pizza. Kill him. Careful there, Bumpsies. Where are you running off to? smoothest of everyone here doing this. And I've never done it before. <laughs> I was nervous. I was like, uh... Excuse you. Just because I have sound over this doesn't mean I need your horse point. Distracting me. That one is amazing. My Deer's Nightblade. I have so much stuff for my elf deck. Oh, another one. I always dread the word. Dies, non elf creatures get minus three. Oh, that's amazing. Breaches, the brazen plunderer. He's a monkey. Oh, he's a goblin. Ooh, Elegith. Crossroads. Barger. If you would scry a number of cards, draw that many cards instead. Oh. My elf deck just got way better. Oh. Yeah, I played it. My nap deck is one of my issues way back in the day. You guys all forgot about it. You're like, give me your fifth, fifth strong. You guys don't know strong decks. But you will. I'm excited about the real deck. I mean, wheel is just discard, discard, discard. Who's your commander going to be? Are you going to do Nekusar? Mm -hmm. You need to find a list, put a list together. So you're on EDA track, right? Mm -hmm. Click the plus button on each card mm -hmm. until you get to the bottom. But I'm going to do Grixis. Oh my gosh. Pride of the yeah. Perfect. Another good one for elves. Okay. <gasps> oh! Brr, brr, brr! Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 140 bucks. The Jewel Lotus. What? That's all my money. Everything I spent, I just made back. Jerry, guess what I got? The Jewel Lotus. It's it's Black Lotus remade. It's a hundred forty dollar card. It's the most expensive card in the set. Oh, because it's a zero cost mana? Zero cost three mana. Except the limit on it is you can only use it for your uh, commander. Delicate. Don't damage it. Well, oh, I made my money back. And everyone got to see me open a jeweled lotus. 
Set it down. Stop touching it. Set it down. Jeez, pushing it. Stop. Keep it up, buddy. Sit down. Stop pushing on things. You're good. You have a seat there, right there. Oh, they have music over it. The table movie is definitely going to be on there. This guy is pretty awesome, but he's a kobold. He is a, I was going to get you the sleeve for this guy for your goblin deck. First strike, Minus Trample, partner, but he's a zero one. Hey, I got the Sanger Baron. Ten bucks. Ooh, and a hollow. Orcs, by the way, are back now. I kind of want to make an orc deck, but there's very not that many. They basically made orcs disappear for a while, didn't they? I see you falling on my window pane. I'm safe inside without a place to stay. Because every time... I remember Dragon Mantle. Classic. The Jaloon Tome. Different from the Jaden Tome. By the way, there's tons of new elf stuff for my NAF deck. Black and green elf stuff. Nice. Ugh. Well, that's a thing. Fleshbag Marauder. Always ugly. And look who else they made read. The Fintorm Elves. Remember them? They were from the Snow Edition of Ice Age. Stat-wise, they look exactly like Lone Worlds, it looks like. Yep. Wow, this would be great in my Mono White Life deck. Soul of Eternity's power and toughness is equal to your life total. Mm -hmm. Then Encore, exile from the graveyard for each opponent, create a copy that attacks them and gains haste, which would be bonkers. Hey, again, Arcanum Weaver. This is another good commander. 30 bucks. And another rare. Bell Borka Spectral Sergeant. Note the converted cost of each card as it's put into exile. Balborka's power is equal to the greatest number noted for its turn. Exile the top card, you may play it. Wow. Hey, Sisay's Ring. This is a weatherlight card. And a stupid prismatic piper. Titus Chain, you dumb face. He's the partner of the fact that can pick a color. Basically, you get to add a color to your deck. That's why they call it murder and not muck deck. A cat monkey. That'll be good for my cat monkey deck. Do you have a cat monkey deck? Another one for elves. Path of Ancestry. That one was a rare back in the day. Now it's a common. Return to Dust. Classic. The Vox of Torment. All right, here we go. Another elf. Root Weaver Druid. Each opponent may search the library for three basic lands. They may put one of these cards in the battlefield tapped under your control, the rest under their control. Wow. So every opponent grabs three lands, but then they have to give me one. But then they get the other two. Pretty bonkers. This one. The Wolvid Familiar. At, as long as it's your turn, commanders you control have indestructible. And it's partner. Oh, boy. <gasps> yes! Amareth the Lustrious. Dragon. Whenever another permanent enters the battlefield under control, look at the top card of your library. If it shares a card type with that permanent, you may reveal that card and put it into your hand. Oh. Hey, and I got a Hollow Eye Blight Assassin. Well, guys, that was the stack of cards there. 
with the most important, I'm going to carefully pick this up, careful, careful, being this bad boy right here, the Jewel Lotus. So you may not get it. I mean, don't, don't gamble for packs there, but uh, I mean, I've made my money on, uh, on these boosters um, plus extra. So I'm going to sell this card um, because its value will only go down. So my, my stock estimating on this is sell. I don't know the Mad Money guy. I think he hits the watermelons when it's sell. Break something to the baseball bat. But I think I have to break something to the baseball bat and say sell. So imagine me doing that. Maybe I'll uh, put a little graphic of that. <gasps> sell! But there you go. Bum, 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 bum. All right, so that's enough hype, but that's pretty amazing. Open one of these, so I'm pretty excited. Um, guys, thanks for watching. Check us out. Follow us. We do all things tabletop here at Porcupine Gamers, bringing people together. Um, right now, we're doing a series on D&D. &D. Um, we've got a few more videos coming out next week, um, and then I'll be on vacation for a week. But um, we're also doing Baldur's Gate um, 3 with, of course, my the Yankee character, the Shadow Blade, and Winrin playing through that storyline. And we might have some friends join us to play through the campaign as well. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, subscribe, and have a great day.